When we are having that prayer here, unfortunately, because uh, we received a tackle from members of Church of Uganda, around two, uh, since we were few, and I had a majority of women, so the women disappeared, and I also tried to, to take off. Unfortunately, they followed my, my, my home, they began beating the houses, breaking everything, I had some two million even I, I sold in my car, plus my papers of education, and together with the, the papers of work. So I built the, the, the government of our President Museveni to come into this matter. The police came and joined the attack. Instead of helping to rescue the situation, to allow the, the overnight to proceed well, they instead turned to arrest people that these are rebels who were hiding in, in the claim of praying, which wasn't true. Today, the ninth day of April, at about uh, 2 in the morning, information was received from church leaders of Korean Church of Uganda that a group of Christians affiliated to reform the Afghan church, uh, entered the church, and uh, forcefully tried to conduct prayers. Uh, police officers moved out to the scene and calmed the situation down. But until when the when the when the when the officers reached the scene, they found they they called they confirmed the information as being true, and uh, we arrested uh, some individuals about. Talk to each other so that that matter does not escalate. My my prayer to police. Arrest whoever it is who engages in any criminal. We have talked enough, we shall not repeat it. Use the legal means, use the spiritual means, but don't guard our people. Don't incite violence. Incite violence, we shall take action.